Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for Friday, Saturday, the 7th, 8th this, of September. This is for all signs. We'll see whatever comes up. There's stuff on both sides of this deck, so I'm just going to shuffle it like this. We're going to get two of them. We're going to see what comes up. Don't try to make this reading fit. It may not be for you, okay? I'm going to get two of these, and we'll clarify them at the end. <laughs> Embrace your confusion. Let there be peace and not knowing all the answers. Embrace your confusion. That's a good one, ain't it? It's perfect. It absolutely is. Set boundaries. Protect your precious time and energy. Set boundaries. Set them. Peace and boundaries. And no, I don't know what the name of this deck is. The book has been put away. Four of Swords. We're going to get some more cards. This right here is feeling like you may need a break. <laughs> I need a break. You may be letting go of something. You know, when I see this card, I always think it's the death of an idea. It is. It's the death of a thought. It's the end. It's the end of a thought that you've been holding on to. And sometimes, you know, you have to take a time to release that thought. Or whatever it is. Oh, I got two. I was only going to get one, but... You're thinking about letting go of something you're thinking about walking away or thinking about going back I mean these cards pretty much say it all okay you guys are or we are at a crossroads is it safe to to step over is it safe to Go back? Is it safe to move forward? Am I making the right choice? Somebody is really thinking about the choice that has been presented to them. There's two options. Do I stay or do I go? There's a blue door and there's a red door. What door am I going to go through? The blue door is the future, something new. The red door is the past. Can you see them? Can you see the blue door and the red door right now in your head? The blue door is the new door. The red door is, is the past door. Which door does your heart want? Which door do you want to see open? to make the decision you may have gotten yourself involved in a situation that you thought the grass was greener 
behind the blue door. But come to find out, you may have sacrificed yourself needlessly for somebody or a situation that wasn't well suited for you. You may have dealt with somebody or you may be dealing with somebody that is immature, childish, lazy, negative. And you may want to go back to where things were better. You may want that red door to reopen. Somebody has been enlightened they have <clears throat> somebody has been enlightened by a situation that or from a person it looks like somebody went through the blue door okay somebody went through the blue door so that's what this is a freaking fool did that anyway somebody went through the blue door we're gonna go back to this okay a fool Somebody took a risk and ran through the blue door. Ran through the blue door. I'm going, I'm going for the blue door. They get through that blue door and everything seems good. It seems really, really good. It's exciting, that blue door. And then they come, they come to find out that the person that they're dealing with has no integrity, has no ambition, brings them down. This person has a big ego. This person doesn't put in effort, isn't working hard to, or had didn't work hard to make it work. It's like you were putting in all the efforts so, or so the other person you're dealing with. Somebody went through the, the, the wrong door, okay? They, they decided that they were going to fly. I'm going to fly through that new door because I'm sure the grass is greener over there. I'm sure the grass is greener over there. So I think that what has happened is somebody has been enlightened through suffering. Okay, They have been enlightened by another individual who was on the other side of that blue door that had no follow through. Okay, This person had no... work ethic you know what I mean they didn't put any work into it they expected you to do all the work or the other person to do all the work it's like this person was lazy La I see keep seeing lazy 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 and now somebody has taken the time to become aware of what was really behind that red door They may have thrown away a commitment and perhaps they want that commitment back. You may have been dealing the behind the red door 
I mean behind the blue door, sorry. The blue door, the person didn't want to commit. You go running through that blue door, you get through the blue door, you're all excited, this is great. And now they don't want to commit. So, I feel as though today is a day of taking a time out, let's take a time out, to become consciously aware of where you're going and what door is going to suit you the best. Behind one door, you have somebody that is not putting in any effort, doesn't want a commitment, lazy, no ambition, cowardly. Okay, that's behind one door. Behind the other door, you have something solid, stable. It may not be as exciting as, as the d blue door, as door number one, the blue door. But it's secure and it's stable and it's committed. Somebody may, you know, behind, behind blue door, may have looked better, okay? It may have looked a lot better. But looks sure as hell can be deceiving, can't they? So, I feel like somebody has wasted some time dealing with a negative situation And now they have to make a choice. This nines are closure. To either to close one of the doors. To close one of the doors. That's what this is. You have to close one of the doors. We have Taurus, we have Virgo, we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, we have Leo, we have Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, we have Pisces. Doesn't matter who we have really because we're out here. There's a situation where somebody has to make a decision as to what they want in their future. Do you want to go back? Somebody's thinking about that. They're thinking about going back. They're thinking about reopening that red door. Let's get a couple more of these. It is a day of taking that the time to become consciously aware. That's what this is. But it feels like somebody had lacked the strength to restrain themselves from something that looked real good on the outside. not being very wise. Somebody didn't make made a bad decision. <laughs> Somebody made a bad, bad, bad decision. Mm. <laughs> and now it's time to remove that obstacle from your life and stop lying to yourself about whatever it is that you're lying about. Okay. Eight, eight, eight. The time is now. 
The time is now. You have the power. The power is in your hands with these eights. Go ahead. Make the choice that your heart wants. What door do you want to open? You know what it is. You, you've, you've got that mental picture. I know that you do. There's no way that you don't have how we've started this reading. Go knock on the door that your heart wants. Now we have the King of Cups reversed and the King of Swords reversed. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Mentally trapped. Mentally closed off. I mean, that is exactly what this is. Closed off emotionally. Feeling withdrawn and cold. Trapped in your thoughts. You need to remove those negative thoughts right now right now and open your heart because somebody has absolutely positively closed off their heart because they have made a mistake and went through that wrong door Somebody is stubbornly holding on out of ego, pride. Stuck because of pride. Because of the mistakes that they have made. There's an opportunity for a new path, a new endeavor. And if you just step outside of your comfort zone, and, and basically forgive yourself. Forgive yourself. And I don't even need a card to say that. That's what this is. When, if you can't forgive yourself, that's your ego talking. This, anyway, this is a day about choices. Which door do you want? Don't waste your time. In a situation that has no growth. In a situation where the, the person that you're dealing with is closed off. The person that you're dealing with isn't putting in any effort. Why, why, why? If you want to leave a situation, the time is now. Because while you stay in the situation that you're not happy in, you're growing bitter and you're growing cold and you're growing withdrawn.
So anyway, I feel like today is a day of probably resenting. You're probably feeling resentful for the mistakes that you have made, whether it's you or the other person. That's what I see. This is a day of resent. resent. I mean, I'm sorry to say that, but it is. It's like, you know, people are thinking, and this is thinking, thinking about the, the. I mean, the Eight of Cups reverse, that's what this is, and this is thinking as well. Thinking about the turmoil, thinking about the, the love, thinking about the decisions, thinking about leaving and going back, I mean, or thinking about leaving and going somewhere else, you know, that's what's on the mind. A lot of thinking going on. Think, 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 think. So somebody is thinking about leaving one situation for something better, on the in the in the hopes of something finding something better. But my main message is is the blue and red door. Which door do you want? What door do you want to see open? That is your answer. That's the direction you should go. If you want a new path to unfold and that is the door that you chose, then that is the path that you need to head in. You know, you were confused. I just helped you, didn't I? If you want to go through the red door, if you want to go back to the past, then that's the door that you need to go through. Whatever door you chose should help you with the confusion. Set boundaries. Protect your precious time and energy. Come on now. I just, I just really got, I didn't, I mean, I read it before, but it didn't really click. It just did. Protect your precious time and energy. Somebody has been wasting their time with somebody that isn't well suited for them. That's what this is. Choose the door that your heart wants, please. That's the mature thing to do. Talk to you later.